she was getting smashed. Probably by a black dude with Timberlands. Strong. Wife beater. Tank top. Five twenty in the AM. My wife left yesterday at seven thirty in the morning to work and did not arrive till now. I once gotta ask, you know, what does a self-respecting, so-called self-respecting woman do past two AM or not come home in over twenty-four hours to her husband and her children? Now, before you guys say anything about me winding the clocks or anything like that, let's go see what the TV says. The TV also says the time is officially 5.20 a.m. Saturday. Last she was seen was Sunday, or actually Friday, at 7 in the morning. Children were up all night. Wondering where their mother was or is, uh, their mother showed no concern to return her text messages or to return my text messages in regards to uh, her whereabouts, her safety. Um, her concern was more, I'm going to go have fun with my friends and cheat on my husband openly and not care two cents about my children. Unfortunately, the courts, uh, the laws in the state of Texas um, give women all the benefit of the doubt, leaving the men with no rights whatsoever in regards of, of you know, custody or any uh, rights to property. Um, it's time we wake up people and, and make sure that, you know, everything is 50-50, everything is, you know, not just to the women's favor, but also the men, because there's good men out there that work hard for their families and try to do the best they can. And some people take advantage of these laws and advantage of people that, you know, are hardworking, want to be there for their families and provide. So it's very sad and heartbreaking to, to, to watch the children uh, ask where their mother's at and you have no answers. And the mother doesn't care. The mother doesn't care about being a mother or a wife. Her concern is, you know what? I'm gonna go up and cheat on my husband. I'm hopefully gonna leave my kids behind because I'd rather have fun, have some drinks with friends, hang around with my lovers, whatever. But the priority is not the children. After the children is being made, she's good. You know what I'm saying? She already has children. So after their, after she birthed them, now it's her sexual endeavors. It is sad, but we live in that situation. This is the world we live in now. It's very heartbreaking and nerve-wracking. <sighs> She's arriving now. Good morning, sunshine. Five twenty a.m. It's five twenty a.m. I'll be just seeing you in twenty-four hours. See that YouTube? She locked the door. Yep. She's drunk, hungover, locking the door. She just got smashed. 
by the homie. Has not been seen in 24 hours. Does not care about her children. Does not care about her husband. Walking to cheats on his husband. But this is what the courts is granting rights to. Right, I'm gonna stop it right there. I don't think he got any footage from her after that. From what I see, I see a guy who's invested his life. I see a guy who's invested everything into this marriage. You know what I'm saying? You can hear it in his voice. He knows the situation's over with, but he's invested so much, he just can't walk away. It's tough for him. He doesn't know where to go. He doesn't know what to do. You can hear it in his voice. She checked out. He doesn't feel like a man. It's over. It's over. It was over before she walked out that door. She was getting smashed. Probably by a black dude with Timberlands. Strong. Wife beater, tank top. That's just the facts. Anyway, hope you enjoyed. See you guys next time. One out.